Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Edmund Mindaros, and for today's quick tutorial, I'm going to show you guys on how to pre-up storage disk space after upgrading to Windows 11 updates. So, after upgrading to Windows 11, most of the user will face the disk space issue. So, first, we need to clear the old Windows update files, which means junk files and temporary files to increase the disk space. Alright, so without further ado, and let's go ahead. Ang next step ay dito lang sa searching bar ng ating computer. Ay kailangan mo lang i-type yung desk cleanup. And then click mo lang itong open. And then next, select mo lang itong C drive and click OK. And then next step, dito lang sa desk cleanup. Makikita mo dito yung cleanup system files. So i-click mo lang ito. And then click mo lang itong C drive and click OK. And then next step, ay wait natin na makalculate yung desk cleanup natin. Alright, so ang next step dito ay... Make sure na naka-check itong Windows Update Cleanup. So, i-check mo itong box na to, And then, select ka lang dito ng other files na gusto mong nga-delete. Alright? So, after na uh, makapag-select ng mga files na gusto mong i-delete. So, other information naman dito na Windows keeps copies of all installed updates from Windows Update. Even after installing newer versions of updates, Windows Update Cleanup deletes or compresses older versions of updates that are no longer needed and taking up space. Alright, and then next step, I click mo lang to. Okay, so I click mo lang to. Okay, and then are you sure you want to permanently delete this file? So click mo lang to delete files. And then wait natin mga kaibigan. Alright, so after deleting those unnecessary files, ang next step dito ay kailangan lang natin mag-restart. Alright, so click mo lang to start menu and then click mo lang to restart. Okay, so ganun lang po kasimple kung paano tayo mag pre up storage disk space after upgrading to Windows 11. So, please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more quality content. Thank you guys and see you in my next tutorial.